Okay, so my name is Steven Giovasis and I'm collaborating with Dr. Chintuan Tan. Today we're going to run a demo of a 24 channel filter bank that's running on an analog device's DSP board and is interfaced with a uh, GUI that is being run by Visual C++ and Visual Studio. So I'm going to start with uh, compiling my project, which is on the DSP side, written in C, right here. And I'm going to compile it and build the project. I'm going to connect to the last session, which means it's connected to the um, target board. It's running the little build. Great. And then I'm going to click debug and run, which should start the program running on the DSP board. There we go. Now on the GUI side, I'm going to open uh, Visual C++ 2010 Express. And this has recently been compiled, so I should just run it. It will recompile it and run. So to just give it a second, there we go. So here's the GUI, and as you can see there are uh, 24 channels, a uh, slider for each one, and then sliders for also modifying a batch of six at a time for a quick modification. Uh, I'm gonna run the sample music file. So I'm going to start with shutting off all of the uh, filters at once, using the GUI. And as you can see, that shuts them all off. And then I'm going to turn on a batch of six at a time. So these are the lower frequencies. And keep in mind that uh, each channel can be changed in real time, whether it's the frequency or the Q value, but I'm not going to run through that right now. So here are the lower frequencies. Now here are some of the middle frequencies, hun low hundreds. And then a little upper, upper hundreds. And here are the higher frequencies. And you can change the gains using the sliders and the uh, controls made available. So. That completes a very brief overview of the device. There will be more demos as the project progresses, and if you have any questions or comments, feel free to email either one of us at the addresses displayed.